top 15 military and police dog breeds worldwide. Over the years, dogs have carved a place alongside us humans. They're not just our pets, they're our loyal companions and trusted friends. However, some breeds have proven to be so intelligent that they're actually engaged in active service. Their keen sense of smell, speed, and sheer power has made them important companions to the military, police officers, and firefighters. In this video, we'll talk about the top 15 military and police dog breeds in the world. But before we get into the video, make sure you help us by subscribing to the channel and hitting that notification bell to get notified when we release more great videos like this one. Okay, let's get into the video. Number 15. Mastiff Carrying a regal appearance, Mastiffs can trace their lineage as far back as 2,500 years ago. They can weigh up to 230 pounds, making this good-natured breed very intimidating. They've been known to fight alongside Greek, Persian, and Roman warriors. Mastiffs aren't just guard dogs, they're trained to attack and actually cause some damage. Over the years, however, the aggressive personality of Mastiffs have been bred out and they're primarily known as loving companions. Number 14. Cane Corso the Cane Corso is often mistaken as a pit bull, thanks to their stocky features. They're smart, loyal, high energy, and agile, all characteristics you'd want in a police dog. So why aren't they higher on the list? Well, most people find the breed intimidating. In fact, to be registered, a Cane Corso has to meet specific requirements such as it must be indifferent to gunfire and remains tranquil in presence of inoffensive strangers. Not a good choice for first-time dog owners, the Cane Corso should be handled carefully. Today, very few of them are used for police work, although there's a chance of their numbers increasing. Number 13. Rottweiler Rottweilers were initially used in World War I, playing the role of guards and quickly alerting soldiers of any intruder. Considered to be one of the oldest breeds, their ability to intimidate with just a look makes them perfect for herding. Today, these dogs are less used for police work and more as a companion dog or a farm dog. Number 12. Border Collie Border Collies were first recruited by the British Army in World War I. Their intelligence and speed made them perfect sentries and messengers. Today, however, they're mostly used for herding livestock. Number 11. Siberian Husky the Siberian Husky is perhaps one of the most talkative dog breeds today. They're smart, strong, active, and very vocal. Looking a lot like wolves, their intimidating presence makes them perfect for military work. Like Alaskan Malamutes, the Siberian Husky has been in active duty during World War II and worked alongside U.S. soldiers during Pearl Harbor. These mischievous dogs have a doubled layered coat that keeps them comfortable even during the coldest weather. This characteristic, combined with their strength and agile nature, make the Siberian Husky the perfect sled runners during harsh weather. Today, they're also popular house pets and are recommended for owners who lead an active lifestyle to match the breed's need for physical and mental stimulation. Number 10. Alaskan Malamute Beautiful dogs with fur that goes on for days, Alaskan Malamutes are often mistaken as Siberian Huskies. The two breeds do look remarkably alike and were originally used as sled dogs. During World War II, they performed the same function, working for the U.S. military. The double coating of the Alaskan Malamute keeps it warm and toasty even during the harsh winter months. Intelligent and always eager to please, this breed has a keen sense of smell, which makes them perfect for search and rescue. These beautiful dogs are the state dog of Alaska with a bite force of up to 540 PSI. They can also pull loads as heavy as 3,000 pounds, so it's not really surprising that they accompany rescue teams across harsh terrains. Before the German Shepherd, Malamutes were the first breeds trained by the military for parachute jumps. Number 9. Airedale Terrier Not familiar with the name? That's because the Airedale Terrier is primarily used in Britain as a working farm dog and police dog. They're the largest of the terrier breeds and actually contributed to the development of other terrier breeds, like the cute Yorkshire Terrier. Looking a lot like a large poodle, the Airedale Terrier is known for its intelligence, high energy, and courageous disposition. 
In the U.S., the Airedale Terrier is primarily used for hunting, thanks to its excellent sense of smell. Unsurprisingly, this makes the breed perfect for locating wounded soldiers, sometimes even carrying medical supplies for help. Airedale Terriers are no longer the go-to breed for military and police work. However, they've retained their distinctive characteristics and is still highly regarded by men and women in service. Number 8. Doberman Pinscher Their intimidating features make the Doberman Pinscher an ideal police dog. They're very protective and highly intelligent with ears that can quickly notice any disturbances. Both in World War I and World War II, the Doberman was used as messengers, sentries, and even detection dogs. They were so popular in the Marines that they have their own nickname, Devil Dogs. Working to rescue wounded soldiers through their excellent tracking skills, it's not surprising that there's a dog memorial erected in their honor. The first ever K-9 casualty was actually a Doberman named Kurt, who was buried in what eventually became the World War II dog memorial. Today, you mostly see these breeds serving in the Indian military. Number 7. Boxer The Boxer's intimidating features make them the perfect companion alongside soldiers and police. Don't be fooled, Boxers are just as smart and friendly as any other small breed. They're very active dogs primarily used by the German military during World War I and II. Their sturdy build made them perfect as pack and messenger dogs. In fact, two Boxer dogs, Punch and Judy, were awarded the Dickens Medal for their bravery in 1946, managing to save the lives of two British officers in Israel. Both dogs were badly injured and got the animal's equivalent of the Victoria Cross as their reward. Hopefully, they got a lifetime of treats and cuddles too. Number 6. Dutch Shepherd These dogs became popular in the Netherlands, originally working as sheep herders. It was in World War II that they became part of the German military because of their intelligence and athletic abilities. Today, they're still widely used as military dogs, specifically by the U.S. military. Number 5. Giant Schnauzer Don't be fooled by the adorable face. Giant Schnauzers are known for their intelligence and tracking ability. They were first used by Germany during World War I and II. America quickly saw the breed's potential and used them as part of the Air Force during the Second World War. The most recent use of the Giant Schnauzer in official working capacity was in 2017, forming part of the President's detection detail. Number 4. American Pit Bull Terrier Earning the reputation of fighting dogs, Pit Bull Terriers are not for first-time dog owners. They're stubborn, strong, and intelligent, therefore needing precise guidance. As members of the police and military, these dogs are single-minded and fierce protectors. They're typically taught to chase and subdue criminals with their fierce jaws, but still remain cool when given the right command. Sometimes, though, the pit bull doesn't have to be in action in order to get results. With their reputation alone, these dogs can help with violent crowd control. In World War I, pit bulls were actually used to represent the U.S. in a watchful waiting campaign. Number 3. Labrador Retriever Labradors have a reputation for being very friendly dogs, so why exactly are they used for police and military work? The breed is primarily used for their detection capabilities. Obedient, intelligent, and with a nose that can track almost anything, these Labrador Retrievers were originally used for sniffing explosives. Today, they can also be used to detect drugs, locate missing persons, and work as guide dogs. One of the more popular Labrador Retrievers was Sasha, who served with the military in Afghanistan. She managed to detect multiple explosive devices, mines, mortars, and other weapons. Number 2. Belgian Malinois Intelligent, athletic, and hardworking, the Belgian Malinois is classified as an all-around working breed. They've been known to work as messengers, trained for combat, and can even locate soldiers left wounded on the battlefield. They have a high-intensity demeanor that makes them the perfect companions for Navy SEALs. With the right training, these dogs remain perfectly calm even when parachuting off a plane. In fact, they are the preferred breed for parachute jumps because of their smaller frame compared to German Shepherds. One of the most popular Belgian Malinois is Conan, who is part of the United States Delta Force. 
This veteran served in 50 combat missions and is recognized for his role in the Barisha Raid. The loyal dog chased down the leader of the Islamic State of Iraq and the Levant, or ISIS, and got injured in the process. Fortunately, Conan recovered and even made a visit to the White House, where he was given the honor he deserved. Number 1. German Shepherd The German Shepherd is a confident and courageous breed with a mind that's open to training. They're considered the top breed for military and police work because of their athletic build and eagerness to follow commands. German Shepherds were originally used to send messages across enemy ranks, deliver ammo, and even act as sentries for the military. Their reputation as working dogs started as early as World War I, and today, they remain to be the most prominent dog breed used for security purposes. Just take a look around airports and you'll usually find one or two German Shepherds roaming around with their handlers. Perhaps the most popular German Shepherd is Finn, who was a police dog for England's Hertfordshire Constabulary. Finn and his handler were injured while capturing an armed youth with Finn needing emergency surgery. Fortunately, this courageous dog recovered and went back to active duty after 11 weeks. His story gained worldwide attention and actually led to the passage of Finn's Law in 2019. I hope you enjoyed the video. Check out this next video I'm sure you will love unless you hate dogs. Below in the description, you can download your very own PDF version of some awesome dog training. Absolutely free, so make sure to check it out. Thanks for watching.